Hey guys, I'm Ryan Goodkin, and today we're going to be talking about ashwagandha. So ashwagandha has, is an herb that has been used in traditional medicine for centuries. It's a fantastic herb. It's considered an adaptogenic herb. And what does that mean? It really means that you're able to adapt to physiological and psychological stress. Typically with ashwagandha, you, you want to look for a product that has standardized extract. So you want to look for a product that has a withanolide concentration, which again, the withanolides are the active constituents of the ashwagandha plant. So typically though, they range from 1.5% to 35% withanolide concentration. That's a big range. If you're using a product that has 35% withanolide concentration, sometimes that can actually be a little bit too much. This product is used for, to help with stress relief as a calming effect, but used in really high doses potentially can sort of cause people to sort of feel less engaged in their daily activity. I hate to say that it would make you feel lazy, but it can, it can certain that some of the reports that come in from people is that, that it makes them feel like they've, they've just lost interest in doing their daily activities. So looking for a product such as KSM 66, that is one of the brands that is standardized, standardized with analyte content of about 5%. 5 to 10% with analytes. It's an it's an alkaloid. It has other amino acids and other other benefits associated with that product. I think ashwagandha as part of a stress support is an important part of of fixing that issue. Again, stress is one of my pillars of health. So, looking for a supplement like ashwagandha, I think it's a fantastic addition. It can be taken in the during the day preferably in the later part of the day. Uh, but again, it's not going to affect your productivity as long as you're maintaining that with analyte concentration, usually about 10% or below. Thanks for tuning in. Please like and subscribe to my channel, at Ryan Livegood. Thank you and be well.